to the channel. I hope you're having a great day. I am doing this video a little differently than my other wig reviews because today I'm not reviewing a wig. I am reviewing a topper. I love toppers. Uh, they are the type of hairpiece I'm most comfortable with. So I was super excited to try out some new ones by Ellen Villa. This collection is her top power collection. These are brand new toppers that she has released and they have some beautiful colors. I absolutely love the Ellen Villa Color Collection. Now this one that I have for you is called Fizz. It is a super cute little bob with a few layers on the end to help kind of blend in with your own bio hair just so nothing is blunt and it blends in really well. Now this topper is unique because it is a hand tied lace front which a lot of toppers do not have a lace front and I personally, I don't love a lace front. They are not my favorite kind. Some people absolutely love a lace front and that's all they wanna wear. Um, with me, I like to blend in a little bit of my own hair in the front and you can't do that with a lace front. Um, so it's just a matter of preference of what you like, but this one is a lace front. Now this one is unique. I have never seen the uh, clips uh, spaced so far apart. This is 11 inches across and it clips temple to temple pretty far to the hairline, or sorry, pretty close to the hairline, not further back in the hair, but very close to the hairline right here. And then at the back of the lace front, it has one more clip and then nine inches down, it has the clip in the back. Now, something you will notice with these clips, um, and I have played around with this piece before I filmed this video, and I'll tell you, I cannot get this to fit securely onto my head. And I definitely have hair to clip it into, that's not the problem. Um, and I definitely know how to clip in a topper, so I don't know what the problem is with this and getting to, getting it to fit securely on my head. But you notice the teeth, um, it's very, very small and very narrow. I think that is the problem why it's not gripping my hair as well as a larger clip typically would. So that is something that I notice is kind of a downside to this topper is the tiny little clips. Um, overall, this is going to be about an eight inch piece and because my hair is longer, I'm going to pull my hair back. So when I clip it on, you will be able to see without my bio hair hanging out at the bottom. Oh, let me tell you about the color. This color is called Mocha Rooted. It is a medium brown and it has some beautiful light brown and auburn pieces, maybe a smidge um, on the blonde side for some of these auburn pieces running through it. So it definitely gives a beautiful highlighted look and it has a dark root, which I absolutely love. Okay, let me show you how I clip this on my head. Now, if you are new to toppers, Something important to remember is do not part your topper off of your head and then try to match it up with the part on top of your head. It will make your part or your whole piece sideways. So the best thing to do is to put it on your head, center it on your head, and then go about fixing the part. Um, so I went ahead and parted my hair because with a lace front, you want to make sure your hair is where it needs to be before you put the topper on because you're not going to do any blending and you don't want anything um, kind of weird underneath it. So you're going to, oh my stars, this one piece just keeps wanting to flop forward. Let's see if I can get it to lay still. Okay, let's try this again. All right, so you want to put the lace front flat down onto your head and you want it center. So this is pretty center. Now again, these clips are gonna clip right here on my hairline. If I go back any further, the lace front is going to be up into my hairline. You see what I mean? You gotta get the lace front onto your skin, but you gotta get these clips far enough back where they grab hair. Maybe I have a weird shaped head. I don't know, but I've never had a, a topper with this issue. Now, I can't even grab a lot of hair in this clip because, okay, I got it to close. I was having a hard time getting it to close earlier because I think I had too much hair in the clip, but I couldn't get enough. Now you see, even, I just can't get this thing to be secure. So, I don't know if you can see, but I'm pushing this down and it keeps popping open because I have too much hair in it. So if I take some hair out and it closes, it's moving around on my head. <laughs> so I'm kind of disappointed that I can't get it to fit securely because it is a really cute topper. 
Now, just envision that my hair is this length and my bio hair is under here. Um, this is what it would look like, and I think it's really cute and a really great style and a really great color. However, it just, I mean, I just can't get it to fit secure onto my head. Now, this is the issue with the lace topper that I have. Um, sorry, a lace front that I have. Now, if this were not a lace front, this is just a standard front, I could take this hair and kind of blend it in. But because it's lace, you can see all your hair underneath where it's supposed to, there we go, that's a little better. Um, it's just really hard with a lace front. Like you can get it looking good, but if for some reason your topper moves, it's gonna go further back on your head and then it's just gonna not work. So this is how it looks. I feel like I have to hold really still and not move it around because it's gonna fall to the side. So this is it. Um, a great chin length little bob. Like I said, the cut is really cute. The fibers feel really good. They're a tiny bit on the shiny side. You may want to put some powder on it to kind of tone down the shine. And I really, really love the color. It just, the fit is not working for me. So let me give you a 360 so you can see all, the, and you're gonna see my ponytail in the back. Just ignore that. It's just the joys of a topper. And this is the right side. Okay. Woo, and I just hit my, my camera there. Let me just move that. Okay. <laughs> Again, this is the Ellen Villa uh, Fizz Topper, part of the Top Power collection that she has done. The color is Mocha Rooted. I don't know if I can recommend this topper simply because I can't get it to fit secure onto my head. I think if they changed out those clips, made them bigger, and allowed it to grip more hair, I think they'd be onto something because this is a really cute style and a beautiful color. Okay, if you want to go ahead and give it a try, head on over to wigs by pattysprouts.com. Again, the manufacturer is Ellen Villa and the style is Fizz and I am wearing Mocha Rooted. Okay, I'm gonna go put on another one, see if I can get that one to grip. I will see you guys next time. Bye.